You know, honestly, I thought the inside would be a lot worse. Welcome to the Investment Properties for Sale show, folks. Thing is selling at or above list. We are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education. We take you to the video tour. Won't watch TV, giving it to you straight. $5,000 houses. What? Yeah, that's what we're talking about, y'all. I got you guys a house today for the low, low price of $5,900. The address, 10117 Hampton Ave, Cleveland, 44108, right? This is a duplex, and as you could see from the footage, uh, it needs a lot of work, but that should be expected because the house is $5,000. Now, uh, believe it or not, Throughout my illustrious career of being the number one investor-focused agent in the Cleveland market, I have sold many houses in the price range of $5,000, and I've dealt with many buyers and realtors and investors and all this stuff, right? I've sold $200 million worth of real estate, and through that uh, career, you would be shocked at how many people uh, would reach out to me on, like, $5,000 houses and be like, hey, is this thing livable? Hey, is this thing moving ready? No. No, bro. It's not moving. It's $5,000 for a freaking house. Of course it's not moving ready. No, no, no. Of course not. As a matter of fact, folks, this one is condemned at the moment. Okay? So uh, it is on the condemned list. And uh, we should, I imagine my guys probably have popped that on the screen here so you guys can see uh, these violations would need to be, of course, corrected to get yourself off the condemned list. But all told, I mean, you got to do everything here, right? This property is not like a training wheel property. This is not a starter property, right? I know some people out there in the world, they're like, oh, the very first house I do should be the very, very cheapest house. I'll dip my toes in the water, see if real estate works for me, and then move on to bigger deals. Okay, uh, not exactly, right? Uh, this house, yes, this is probably like the cheapest house you could possibly buy, right? It's friggin' $5,000, but that does not mean this is an easy deal. No, no, no. This is, uh, you know, there's a lot of work that goes involved in taking a house that is this beat up, this torn up, this, uh, this jacked up. I mean, it's condemned, again. Uh, it's a lot, right? There's a lot that goes into this. So if you have no experience in real estate, this deal ain't for you. If you're not local to Cleveland and you have no resources in Cleveland, no team on the ground, you're thinking the only way you can make this happen is by asking me 101 questions such as, what's the ARV? How much does it cost to fix this? How much does it cost to fix that? How much does it cost to fix this? Can you give me an estimated timeline on your repairs? How much to do the kitchen? How much to do the bath? Can you take a little bit of money off of that? Can you take a little bit of money off on this? Can we get two or three more other bids in here? Et cetera, et cetera, right? If you're thinking that is how you're going to be able to get this deal done, this deal is not for you, right? Who this deal is for is for my investor group out there of seasoned, sophisticated investors and or contractors who know what they're doing when it comes to fixing up highly distressed and dilapidated properties, right? As far as getting renovation bids, handling your scope of work, things of that nature, uh, we will be able to get buyers or buyer's representatives into this property anytime they like. Just reach out to our team, sales at holtonwise.com. We will get you or your representative into the property. You could bring any amount of contractors you like, uh, and they could go over that scope of work. Again, I cannot stress this enough. I do not feel like this deal makes any sense for somebody who doesn't have experience in these types of deals, right? The people that are actually going to buy this property and see success with this property are people that already know what's going on. And what they really need from me uh, is to be able to see the condition of the property right now in a very uh, quick and easy, simple way, which we are doing by providing you guys with that footage. And then they'll be able to follow up further with an on-site uh, inspection, either themselves or through their representative uh, who knows how to do this, right? I think 
think, uh, you know, your locals, right? People that are actually contractors themselves and they need uh, filler work for their crew. Sophisticated Section 8 landlords who've been doing this a very long time, who have a bunch of properties in neighborhoods like this. These are the kind of people uh, that should make sense, right? So this is the last time I'm going to say it. If you're not one of those people, I will absolutely take your $5,000 and sell you this property. But if it doesn't go well for you or it doesn't work out how you thought it would or the process of uh, handling this investment property or dealing with this renovation turns out to be difficult, I do not want to hear any crying when you're like, oh, James, oh, I'm an engineer in Sacramento and I bought this house because it was cheap and I thought it was going to be awesome and then it wasn't awesome and it was really, really hard. People were mean to me. I ain't going to give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? Because I told you. I done told you like six times in the video this shit ain't for you, bro. This ain't your bag. But if it is your bag, folks, uh, you know what to do. You can make offers, right? We're going to, of course, need cash offers. You're going to want to send those to sales at HoltonWise.com when you send in the cash offer. I'm going to need you to include your proof of funds. When I say proof of funds, I mean a screenshot of your bank account. I do not want to see a screenshot of a hard money loan pre-approval. A hard money loan is not cash. A hard money loan is what? It's cash. No, it's not. Not it's hard money loan, bro. It's it's cash. A hard money what? A hard money loan. A hard money what? A hard money loan. It's cash. What's the third word in hard money loan, bro? Loan. So it's not cash. You know what I'm saying? I'm sick of having that fucking conversation with people, right? So I need actual cash in your bank account with your name on it. Not a pre-approval for a hard money loan, right? This is going to be a cash-only deal. However, I do need to let you know. If at some point you renovate this particular property and then you decide to do a cash out refinance or you are interested in investing in the Cleveland market and other properties where financing is accepted and you are looking for a high quality lender to take care of you no matter what state you live in, you are going to be very pleased to discuss with my friend and colleague, Harjeet from Trust Mortgage, who is going to be able to take care of your investor needs. She is writing loans for investors in all 50 states, on properties in all 50 states, 25% down. We could do 30-year fix, 15-year fix. She's doing adjustable rate mortgages, the whole thing. You guys are having trouble out there right now trying to navigate the space when interest rates are like, ah! They're like a freaking roller coaster. Harjeet and Wintrust Mortgage are here to help you guys navigate those waters, right? She's got insight into the mortgage industry uh, that your average Joe Schmo ain't going to have. So that is a wonderful contact for you guys when you're investing in properties that are not this property because as has been previously discussed, I do not want to see any hard money loans. I'm talking cash only offers, folks. You want to make those offers. They must be as-is cash offers. Again, those need to be sent to sales at HoltonWise.com. You want to get into the property, send an email to sales at HoltonWise.com. We'll get you into the property. If you're working with your own uh, local Cleveland real estate agent, all of this very same information and how they could submit the offer or how they could uh, take you on a tour of this particular property is going to be in the broker remarks section of the MLS. If your realtor is not able to navigate that and they're having trouble uh, trying to figure out how to actually get you in there, please do not email us telling us that. In fact, what you should really do is then turn to them, say, hey, bro, you're really bad at your job. I'm firing you and I'm getting a new realtor because like that is like freaking being a realtor 101, you know, not very difficult. Those must be the same realtors that are emailing my team like, yo, is this $5,000 house livable? No, Susan, it's not. It's fucking $5,000. What in the hell? You know what I'm saying? She must be working with clients who are not meant for this property, but I think you might be. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.